Hello and welcome. My name is Molly and this is a seated dance moves class. So everything we're doing today, we are doing in a chair. There will be lots of arm movements. There will be some leg movements, some lean and side to side, working that core. You're going to get a little bit of everything. Make sure you have a chair that you are about 90 degrees with. And if you aren't going to be using your legs today, you can always just use the upper body. I will give you options for lots of different abilities. Okay, we're gonna start with just a little bit of a warm up. So we're gonna reach overhead nice and slow, reach up and switch sides. Nice and easy, we're just warming up. This is a new chair for me. <laughs> and it's very cute, and it's like a wide base, so it fits my big booty. But you know, when you like order things on Amazon late at night, and you order it based on who you think you are versus who you actually are. I don't know who I thought I was ordering a white chair. March it out. I've had this chair for maybe two weeks. There's already a stain. <laughs> There's a stain and they're like, it's all ripped apart from Quinn. And I was like, but when I ordered it, I was like, I'm an aesthetic girly. I'm gonna rock this white chair. I'm never gonna get it messy. <laughs> who I am in my head versus who I am in reality are two very different people. <laughs> We're just gonna lean forward and back, plant your feet, lean forward and back. So I'm kind of using my arms, doing kind of like tiny push-ups on my legs. <sighs> Keeping my back straight. Again. We just want to warm up the upper body. Warm up your arms, pushing away. For four, good. Three, two, one. Back to reaches, up and over. And center, yes. Reach. Now if you don't have a wide chair, you can always hold onto your hip as you're reaching to the side, or if you have armrest. <laughs> I could not find that word in my brain. <laughs> Two more. Reach. March it out. Good, and if you're not using legs, just give me big, energetic arms. We just want things to warm up. So to get your heart rate up a little bit. You should feel that core. That core is what pulls the legs up. Four, three, two, push-ups. Down and up. Nice, shake it out. Okay, our first real dance song. You know I love like a little folk guitar moment. You know I love it. So, your first move, you're gonna do two heel taps, two taps to the side. We're gonna start with the legs, we'll add on some arms, okay? You got three, two, taps forward. Two, take it side. One more time. Now your arms are gonna do the opposite of your legs. So reach or opposite arm and leg, then out, out, reach, reach, out, out, again, reach. Now the course is where we get real fancy. You're gonna get lots of chances with it. So this first one, just learn it, just figure it out. Arm side, give me two airplanes, down, down, then sharp, circle out, lean, lean, sharp, and circle. Follow me. <laughs> Back to heels. That's it. Those are your two moves. enjoying the music, getting used to moving around in your seat. Again. 
One more. Okay, you know the chorus. Make it even sassier. Big reach, reach, reach. Bring it in, out. Do you feel your obliques? Do you feel your obliques? They're working. They're working for you. They're working overtime. Again. Big lean. Lean. Two more. Take it forward. There's no distance in between, darling, you and me. Make this thing complete. We go drifting out to sea, making memories. You ready? Put that core to work. Reach, reach, in, out, round. Yes. The, um, the obliques are employee of the month. Every month. <laughs> Down. Again. One extra lean for us. <laughs> okay. You're gonna reach around, knee drive. Reach, knee, drive. Reach, knee, drive. Some options. You can use that hand to pull up if you need. Pull in that leg. Good. So then you're working your upper body and your lower body. Is it a modifier or is it a progression? I don't even know. Are you adding on to it or are you making it your own? <laughs> Give me a little disco arms. Then you're gonna cross open up. Disco. Cross open up. One more. Big arms. Reach up for two. Reach down for two. Yes. Reach. Reach. Let that torso get involved. Naturally moving around with those arms. Yes, maybe you lean. Lean. Push away. Little twist. Twist and push. Nice. Circle down, circle. Knee, drive. I feel like the secret with dancing is it doesn't even need to be super hard, right? Like those big reaches. But the way you make it dancey is you allow your torso and your body to naturally react. Sometimes in fitness, we're really focused on like tightening everything to keep good form. In dance, you want things to re uh, react to the movement, right? So my shoulders are shimmying, my chest twists, my shoulders move, my chest reacts versus No. <laughs> you let your body move. Work two. Take it down for two. Big push. Two. Music. 
two songs left. This one, we just talked about it, let the shoulders react to the music. We're gonna point across, lean, push away. Like you see somewhere at the club, you're like, come here, oops, actually, no thank you. <laughs> you give consent, you take it away. <laughs> you can change your mind at any time, baby. Reach, pull them in, say never mind, point. Bring them in, never mind, point. Now you're gonna snap down, two curls. Snap, snap, two. Remember we just talked about it. Use that body versus point. Lean, push. Lean. Again. Now I want to see that style. I want to see that body move right here. Down. Curl. Everyone's groove is going to look a little different. Down. <sighs> Have you ever seen someone like dancing and they're like not a good dancer, but you could just tell they are living in the moment and having so much fun that it makes it attractive, like it makes them a good dancer. That's the energy. In and out. It's not about how you look. It's about the aura, the energy you are putting out into the world. One more. Hold here. Snap it down. Oh, girl. You've been working that thing tonight. Make it a little bigger. Again, reach. <laughs> Again. Just groove. <laughs> One more song. We're putting the bangs behind the ears. We're getting serious. <laughs> Hands behind your head. You're gonna lean up. Lean up. Can you get your elbow to your knee? Remember how I said the obliques are employee of the month every month? It's because they're working right here. <laughs> You're gonna go single, hold, circle. So you're making a little phone and you're like, what? The person from the club is calling you up and you're like, who's this? I don't even remember you. <laughs> Heel out, heel, throw. Heel, throw, now push. the top yes you know I'm the one for you you should feel your core I'm also like actively pushing into the floor with my feet to kind of help me get back up push down away yeah so even though you're sitting those legs are active those legs are working your phone's ringing 
Your phone's ringing. Who is it? Hit, hit, pull. No, thank you. This song's like, call me if it's only for a night. And I'm like, don't call me. Not even for a night. <laughs> You can tell I'm a millennial by the way I'm doing my phone. Like, I feel like kids nowadays do this. Weird. Take a moment. Final drop. Hit. Push. Hit. Hit. Push it. Take a breath. Amazing job. I love a seated workout. I think they're so fun. They really help me get into my body and just kind of like relax into the movement. I don't have to think about half of what my body is doing. I'm just vibing. I'm just grooving. Y'all, let me know in the comments below if there's anything specific that you need from these seated classes. Do you need more, um, Core engagement, you need less legs, you need more arms. Let me know what you are looking for. I want you to get the most out of these classes. Let's take three deep breaths together. Breathe it in. Let it go. Two more. Last one. Hands come to your heart. Take a moment to be proud of you spending a couple minutes on just you. My name is Molly Day. And I will see you next time. Mwah.